Hi, guys. Welcome back. Today's topic is linked list in Java. How it works internally in Java? The linked list class in Java implements list and DQ interfaces. Linked list implements it using doubly linked list. The private class node provides structure for the doubly linked list. An item variable for holds the value and to reference to node class itself for connecting to next and previous nodes. Understanding the node class. Private static class node e, e item, node e next, node e prev, node, node e prev, e element, node e next, this dot item equals element, this dot next equals next, this dot prev equals prev. A graphical representation of linked list. Let us visualize how a node looks like. It connects with other nodes through next and previous references. This is how a doubly linked list looks like. the link first method works the link first method is used to add an element at the beginning of the list the implementation of this method looks like this private void link first e final node ef equals first Final node e new node equals new node null e f first equals new node if f equals equals null last equals new node else f dot prev equals new node size plus plus mod count plus plus the first and last node class references which always refers to the first and last element of the linked list transient node e first transient node e last. So, when the very first element is inserted into the list, first and last both refer to this new node. What happens when another element is inserted at the beginning of the list? The node F will hold the reference to the node which was the first element before this insertion. Assign the reference to the newly created node, first equals new node. The first element before this insertion is at second position now, so its prev element should store a reference of the first node. The constructor of the node class helps in storing the reference of the second node. Let us now understand the link last method. The link last method is used to insert element as the last element of the list. The implementation of the link last is void link last e final node el equals last. Final node e new node equals new node l e null last equals new node if l equals equals null first equals new node else l dot next equals new node size plus plus mod count plus plus here it is the very first element which is inserted in that case both first and last references point to it. If elements are already there in the linked list then the node, which is currently the last node of the linked list, will become the second last node now. The newly created nodes prev should store the reference to this second last node. of the 
second last note should store the reference to the note, which is the last note now. So, how the add method works? The add method is used to insert the specified element at the specified position in this list. The implementation looks somewhat like this. Public void add, int index, e element, check position index, index, if, index equals equals size, length last, element, else link before, element, node, index, Method implementation is void link before e node e successor final node e predecessor equals succ.prev final node e new node equals new node predecessor e successor succ.prev equals new node if predecessor equals equals null first equals new node else predecessor dot next equals new node size plus plus mod count plus plus Like this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates.